Have you ever seen a living fossil before? This tree was thought to be extinct for over 50 million years. This is the Dawn Redwood, Metasequoia glyptostrobodes. The unusual thing about this is it's a living fossil. It was found throughout the Northern Hemisphere, but it was killed off during the Ice Age. But in 1941, the Arnold Arboretum found a living example in Sichuan Province in China. At the end of the Second World War, they sent another expedition over and they gathered up seeds and they brought them back and planted them in 1948. This is actually one of the oldest examples of the tree outside of China. The mission of the Arnold Arboretum is to try to find as many different plants and shrubs that can grow in the New England environment. And they send expeditions around the world in order to do it. This, uh, this tree was rescued from extinction by the Arnold Arboretum. And as a result, they use that as its emblem, as it exemplifies the, the mission of the Arnold Arboretum. The unusual thing about this tree is it is a deciduous conifer. So what that means is that the leaves will eventually fall off of this tree uh, during the winter time, as opposed to an evergreens. You can find examples of these trees in the Arnold Arboretum, as well as the Boston Public Garden. Both genders are found in each tree, which doesn't require cross-pollinization. It will actually fertilize itself. It produces these unusual small cones, and you'll find that these trees have a tendency to grow uh, right next to each other in groves. This is actually one of our newest additions to the Boston Public Garden here. When you leave the, the, the tree ungroomed, the root structure has a tendency to grow larger when an ungroomed tree. So this is an example of the tree that's been properly groomed. The root structure is not as massive as some of the ones where they are ungroomed. Also, it doesn't have the armpit structures like the ones uh, in the ungroomed trees. Because they're such fast growing trees, this is one of the tallest trees in the public garden. So it grows at least one feet, possibly two feet a year. So as Boston Park Rangers, part of our responsibilities are to actually educate the public with uh, things such as the trees and park history. So if you see us on patrol, feel free to ask us questions. If we don't know the answer, we can certainly find out.